we have the need to um, to grow, and one or the step was uh, to be independent, to 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 have our own space, and to be a mission, uh, and that was we was um, we worked with that vision. We wanted something that we can run in our time, our space, when we want it. And the time during the week that we want it to develop the schedule like we want it. And we start um, and to think about that when the pandemic time comes. We never stop. Pastor never stop. Even online, when the when the times were tougher with the pandemic, she even uh, did uh, services online, so uh, all of us could have uh, received the word of God. Well, this building I found it by marketplace on Facebook. We had to do some renovations in this building. Uh, God gave Pastor Haddock the, the vision to how to expand within the building to make more space for, you know, for the members and to be more comfortable. So we have, we have to remove some walls. When we start, we were sitting the people in this direction, looking to that um, screen. Then um, we need to, this wall, we had this, a wall here and another wall in this area because that was a separate room. When we start to work, we need to move this wall first and this wall first and to, um, in order to, to have more space for the, for the music band and for the worshipers. In this area, this was a wall that, that was my office. Here was one wall, this is the second wall, and there a third wall that we have to broken to open the space to seat more people. We had another wall here that made, that was, and they was doing um, two rooms. And we moved this wall that was here to create a big room like this. Here we got um, the Sunday school, three Sunday school, kids, juveniles, and youth. And we have the meals and the activity in this um, area. Um, I start to work a lot a lot with the community in one of the things that we were offering food in the parking. We started giving away a thousand uh, boxes of food and then we, end, uh, we finished with probably like I, I said 1,500 to 2,000 boxes every other week. So we had a, a, lot, of, a lot of members that came through is a result of those um, ministry, the food pantry. I think the vision of the pastor has to grow in all ages, and um, it, it give it give us a lot of programs that we can get involved. It's a university in Puerto Rico called uh, University Theological University of the Caribbean, um, and they are giving us the classes on Monday night because then on Wednesday we have the the praise services. We sing and we are, uh, we started with four, four people and the praise services, then it, it grew uh, uh, eight and 10 and 12, and now we have 20, 25, and you know, the praise services is the smallest service in the whole, uh, in all churches. And on Friday we have discipleship and the discipleship is bringing people and we are talk, talking about healing and how, how the healing is important in order for us to grow spiritually. And of course, Saturday we have choir rehearsal and Sunday we have the service. 
We have a heavy, we have a busy week. <laughs> when we was in Roulette, in, in, num, in, in books, on books, we, we was um, around 50, 40 something, 50 members. But the average of the service uh, was um, 25, 30, 30 something. Maybe some of them more, but this is the average. And now, in our books, we got around 85 members on books. And in some occasion, we got the average 50, 50, uh, 50 something, 60, um, 70, a lot of time. But also, we are 80 on members, but in some occasion, several occasions, we are having 110, 115 in all the special times. And, and we are praying for what go, what go to be the next step. Because if the space is, is small and the people feel tired, that affects too, that the, the growing of the church.